right, Caleb, so what are we doing today? Building the benches. Building the benches for the table. So this is just a, what would you call this? Just a prop. <laughs> this is actually the one that I had in my laundry room. I got it from the flea market for like $60, but um, Caleb's just kind of going by this for like the height measurements and like the width measurements that we need for the table. So we're building two benches, one for each other table, and then we're going to have chairs on either end. But this way it can seat more people. No, we're not building chairs. We tried to build the bar stools for the island, and what happened? Show them what happened. I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> Somebody cut their finger off. So, we're not building any kind of chairs. We're going to just build benches. Simple, simple benches. Chairs are square too. Okay. So, how long? How long? 82 inches and we're going from the inside of the legs 82 81 okay and how tall are they going to have to be the posts are going to be 15 inches 15 inches are the posts And it's just going to sit on top of the post. So it'll make it 16 and a half inches. 16 and a half. Okay. Here's our little setup we got going. <laughs> and what are these boards from? This is another board that we use for the concrete, isn't it? Huh? Look at the other side of it. It looked like it had concrete. It might have had it on there, but it wasn't from... It wasn't from that? No. Okay. So then where are these boards from? I think we got these from uh, I don't remember. <laughs> we had them left over from something. Leftover wood from something. So it's just reclaimed wood. And you're going to have to sand this oh, stuff down. Okay. We're going to use this post. Mm -hmm. It's got nails and everything else off of it. This is going to be <laughs> what the legs are going to be made out of. Where did the post come from? The building that we tore down? I think, I think so. I think so too. That's all we got Ooh, look at them dimples. <laughs> Don't you give him a smile, Caleb? <laughs> Got it.
Are they even? Yeah. You wouldn't tell me even if they weren't, would you? The one corner has a little chip in it. But... I wish you could see this video because the light is shining right on you. God is shining his light on you. So you don't cut another finger off. Leg four. We got four legs. Oh no, we got five legs. <laughs> we got six. It ain't gonna be long enough. Well, darn it. Oh well, at least we got four legs. Well, what? Put it to save. Look, coasters. Oh my gosh. <laughs> coasters. <laughs> you got a two and one deal, huh? Leg posts and coasters. <laughs> All right, our second post. So where was this one? Where did this one come from? This is one of the leftovers from the house. Uh -huh. Actually, I think this one's leftover from the table. From the table. Mm -hmm. I had it left over. <laughs> It's a beautiful day to build something, ain't it, Caleb? a wee bit short. <laughs> More coasters! <laughs> Don't know. You'll save it for something though, I'm sure. Don't worry, it won't go to waste. Not around here. Our whole carport is full of wood. <laughs> that we don't know what to do with yet. A lot of it's going to probably be done in the pantry. But we don't have everything we need for the pantry. Which is why we're doing the benches. <laughs> it's not just our ADD kicking in. <laughs> we are going to get to the pantry. Just not today. <laughs> today is benches. So is an inch too short? Like an inch difference too short? Uh, uh -huh. You want a little space in between the legs, don't you? I guess. Just a little? Yeah, sure. I don't know what he's talking about. We'll just agree. <laughs> Do you like building things, Caleb? Sometimes. Sometimes. Would you, if you could quit your job and become a builder, Probably. you would do it? Except for the winter time. Except for the winter time. Why? It's cold. It's cold. <laughs> oh, I imagine you would just bring it in the house. <laughs> what do you mean, like building what? I don't know, tables and islands and. Oh. Well, yeah, then I can 
Just build a shop. It's gonna be fine. Build a shop. Build a shop. And yeah. Do it all inside all the time. Maybe one day you'll get your shop. So what are you doing with the seats now? That's all I gotta do to them. Why is it so short? What are you, what? Why are you cutting so much off of them? I thought they were eight foot. The table's eight foot. We're going in between the legs. Yeah, but it shouldn't cut that much off of them, should it? I mean, that's 80 inches. I just took two inches off from the bottom. Okay. And just a little over a foot. We can go double check the measurements. I think we should do that. Measure twice, cut once. This is actually probably the fourth time we've measured. <laughs> I said this is actually probably the fourth time we've measured. <laughs> do -do -do. Just under. Oh my god, that's eight foot. <laughs> Well, those are over eight foot. Whoa. Okay, yeah, I guess. Because there's about, what, five or six inches on each side, and we're going to the middle, and that's three and a half, so, yeah, it's probably about a foot. Ooh. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. 80 inches. 80 inches. Yokey dokey. A little ironic sitting on a bench to make a bench Smash your finger either. You need me to do something? I can't move that block out of the middle now. Hold on. Just leave it alone for a second. That's what you call rustic, you guys. Actually, those might not be left over from building this house. I don't know where those are left over from. <laughs> left over from building a house. From building what? A house. A house? At some point, you know. Oh, you're making me nervous with your fingers.
That'll be nice. That's why we're going for the rustic look because nothing we ever do turns out perfect looking. So, rustic is our specialty, isn't it, Caleb? <laughs> Might turn out better if we actually use good stuff instead of good stuff instead of old war out. Lumber that's been sitting out there for 16 years. 16 years? <laughs> we ain't even lived here 16 nah. years. Mm -hmm. If anything, it's been laying out there for like a uh, 10 years. <laughs> you could have, you know, pushed them in a little bit and left a little bit on the edge hanging off. No, I didn't. Too late now. You can move them out, can't you? No. No? No. You always wanted to know about what knot. About no, what about it? Always at least one that's in the knot. Oh. That's our look. You can put one right here. You can put one right here. I would, just saying, but I'm not a carpenter or anything. Neither, because we're going to have the angle boards on there. This is just to hold the legs to it, so when we pick it up, okay. it won't come off. i got to shave this one. you got to shave it? you got to make another coaster? Yeah. Give me my pencil over there. shorter. Yeah, because that's a little more than an inch and a half. What? The top. Because it's got two. It's got the press board put together and then little legs. That's going to be really short. No, it's not. That ain't going nowhere. You gotta do it, Kayla. It might need one in the middle. I told you I needed one in the middle. I mean, that's me sitting on it. Yeah. We built them for guests, for parties, so everybody would have somewhere to sit. So it's definitely gonna have more than just you sitting in the middle of it. Well, we need to put one in the middle. It could be just a little bit higher. Really. But it's not no, much different than that one. Well, it's too late now. <laughs> so it don't really matter. <laughs> put one in the middle or two? Uh, I don't know. I think one would be sufficient, don't you? Why? I don't got no post. You don't got no more posts. Well, we gonna, you can use a two before. As long as there's something in the middle and it's going to be up right, so I think it would be fine. Don't you? 
I would just put, or two two befores. Block them together. Whatever. Can you slide it in between the table legs? Yeah. Perfect. Now. Oh, it's going to look so good once we get it stained. I hope we still got some stain in there. Oh, <laughs> it's so cute. I love it. Love it, love it. Between the end and there, would be 60. So we're going to redo the other one and we're going to put an overhang in between the legs so that way we ain't got to put one in the middle. What about here? I mean, that's a lot. That is way too much overhang. That's four quarters. Uh, I think that's way too much overhang. I think about where that one's at. This one? Yeah. A whole foot overhang? That's right there. I don't know. Too much? It looks a bit much to me. That looks a little better, but with it in a foot, it would be more stable in the middle, I feel like. And I can put an angle on both sides. I don't know about that. Then let's do it like this and put the angle on the other side. On which side? On the inside? Okay. Alright. Sounds good, bruh. Bruh, bruh. <laughs> do you know me? See you taking that hammer and pulling it back and hitting yourself in the eyeball with it. <laughs> I got a little bit of anxiety, you guys. We don't like knots. Oh, Do we, Caleb? Knots are no good. Yeah, that looks a lot better. With them, with an overhang like that. The bottom needs to come out this way. They also had a little block in the middle of the legs in that picture that I showed you. Did they? Yeah. I can take the coasters. The coasters. <laughs> so did everybody like not have somewhere to sit at the twins party? Because it looked to me like everybody had somewhere to sit. I mean. Nobody 
Nobody said it's the island. Nobody said it's the island. No, the school stayed put it all the time. They probably didn't send it to Alan because it had a tablecloth over it. Yeah, but there were all the cupcakes were on the island. <laughs> Don't you to shave it while we were out there. <laughs> It don't bend. Yeah, yeah, it did. Just a little. Nothing like that one. Okay. Set on seed. Do you think it needs something in the middle? If so, then we don't need to change that if we're going to put one in the middle. I don't think it's in the middle. I don't like setting in the middle of things. Oh.
Tilt that one down. gotten a bit dark outside. Um. What? Um, does it have to be so far down? I mean, I don't know. Whatever you gotta do, just do it. Probably be better. I mean, this isn't going to add sturdiness to the seat. It's going to add. It's not going to sway. Well, what about the longer one? I mean, same thing. <laughs> they do the same. They they tend the same purpose. They just don't sway. I thought it was to help support the middle. No, it's to keep it from rocking side to side. No, because you're putting the pressure up here and the pressure is going down to the thing instead of right, not well, having no pressure in the middle. You need to go from here to here. Well, I mean... I'm not saying it don't help none. I'm saying its sole purpose is not that. Its sole purpose is to help from shifting from side to side. Okay. Let me see the longer one again. How, how many inches would you say that one is? 40. <laughs> okay. Um. You just want to use the little ones. Well, I like the bigger ones. <laughs> Too much. 
much of an angle. I told you you had to get the right angle. You said you can only do one angle. Put it up higher. It should be 45 in the corner. I don't know what I was thinking. Well done. Dang. So now what? I don't think you have the skill song. I need my feet to work. You just say this is where you struggle. He's getting a little frustrated, you guys. <laughs> he said cut this block down how many times? I don't know. <laughs> You'll figure it out. I believe in you. I don't. <laughs> You got your pencil? <laughs> we don't even care about angles no more. We just gonna draw a line where it needs to be cut and we gonna cut it and that's where it's gonna go. Right. <laughs> I mean, that would be my go-to anyway. <laughs> So it needs to go like straight down like right here. There you go. Look at you. Look at you. We gonna do it this time? No, because it's the exact same way I've been doing it. <laughs> Why? Caleb wants to know why. Maybe. You're just cutting it at too much of an angle. It's a freaking right angle. <laughs> well, mate, is your leg square? Yes. Sure. Yes, I use the speed square, it squares it up. <laughs> How about we just put a two before all the way along to this? No. Why? <laughs> what did you do that time? I just cut it straight off instead of beveling it off. It's two 45 degree angles. You... <laughs> and it, it fits. Because it's the big one. <laughs> like I wanted. <laughs> I don't fit exactly right. It's a better than the other one. <laughs> Go buy a chop saw. A chop saw? Are you I'll doing leave. that one right? Just use the big ones. I'll leave for my chop saw. Uh, but that one was right. But it's not. Just use the big ones. I don't have enough to do all of them like this. Why? Why, why does it work? And that one don't. Because it needs to be a longer thing. I should be able to take the freaking block I got from right here and put it right in this angle and it work. Okay, 45 and you? degrees is 45 degrees. Now explain it to me again. The saw won't let, my saw won't. Your saw won't cut at 45 degrees? Yeah, my guard gets in the way.
and I pulled my card back and it still won't go. So how did the long one do it? it? How did you cut it's it? Cut straight. The blade's straight up and down instead so of So you just have to mark the 45 degree angle and cut it straight. Well, I can't cut it straight if I want it to lay long ways. Um. Instead of straight up and down. See how that one's oh. long ways, and this one's straight up and down. Oh. Okay, so we've decided to just turn the braces the other way instead of doing them like this on the bench. We're gonna turn them and cut them like this because Caleb doesn't have his the other saws anymore. They were actually his daddy's and we were just borrowing them while we were building the house, but he needed them back. So so now all Caleb has to use is his skill saw and it doesn't cut the right angle. So, because something's bent on it or something, I don't know, but anyways. So he's got to lay it like this and cut it or something like, like this. He's got to cut it like this. I don't know. Anyways, it's gonna do the same thing. It's just gonna look a little different. So that's what we're doing. Okay, so after we figured out that little fiasco, we sanded them all down and then we stained them and then it was time to put them on and finish these benches up. It only took us two days, y'all. <laughs> Not really, because we didn't get started until, like, later the night before, so it was already almost dark by the time we got started, so. Here we go. Oh, I don't know. I didn't look at it. Oh, I want that on the outside. Yeah. Show me that character. <laughs> Can I ask, <clears throat> how come you don't ever do pocket holes? Do what? Pocket holes. Because I don't have a lot of drill bits or nothing. Tools. What I got. All right, you guys. This is what they look like. I'm gonna put them at the table now. <laughs> Caleb's testing it out. All right, you guys, that is it for this video. I hope you all enjoyed watching us make our benches for our kitchen table. And I hope to see you all next time. We'll see y'all later. Bye.